Okay, so I want to make this quick video real quick. And yes, I'm, I'm level 55, but here's my problem, right? So to get the last gun, the mini break, right? You have to get this to level 14, right? You have to get the, the nine, the Vaz, Vaznev 9K to level 14, right? I got to level 14. It's still locked. I I just watched Blame Truth's video on the his shotgun, his dragon breath rounds. He wasn't able to put it on his uh, on here, like at all. And it says the ammo, yeah, ammunition's like unlocked at level one. So, like, like I don't understand this. Like, you release a game. The fact that it's got 30 levels is impressive, but you release a game, let's be honest, it's half-assed. It's absolutely half-assed, right? So, I have this, right? I got a gold, right? I, I went all out for this SMG. Alright, that's fine. Gold's fine. Gold's, gold's fine. So, I wanted to use this. I still, it's still locked. Guess what? It's, it's still, still fucking locked. And... It says get it to level 14. This one is to get the FTAC recon to 16. And all these other weapons is for other weapons that I don't use for the most part. Like, I have to get the EVR to level 12. I have to get the M4 to whatever level this shit is. 13. I have to get the TAC 56 to fucking 11. I have to get, like I said, the FTAC. I have to get the Bryce 800 to 16. LMGs, I have to get the M4 to 18. I have to get the Lockman 556 to 16. All the hunting rifles as well. I have to get the freaking Lockman 762 to 17. I have to get the SPR 208 to 13. 20. 16. 17. Like, I, this is the absolute worst way to have people unlock shit. Like, Honestly, just have it like I understand you have like 50 something weapons in this game Considering you have rockets. I'm I'm so besides this you have to get the x12 to 10 to get the x13 auto Like I don't use pistols. I use launchers and that's pretty much it so Here's my problem with the entire situation Why would you release this game in October when it's completely half-assed? There is way too many glitches, way too many bugs. I have crashed probably around 15 times in the last three days. All right. Why release the game in this state? Hell, the beta was better than the fucking actual final product. Like, it, it's absolutely insane. It's completely insane. So, I just wanted to use the mini break or mini back or the PP whatever from MW3. I just wanted to use this gun, all right? That's like the only gun I want to use right now, and I can't because it's glitched. It's gonna stay glitched until they decide to fix it, which they're probably not going to fix it. And this is the same problem that Jeff had in Warzone, if I'm not mistaken. Some guns were locked, and it's it's to the point where wh why release this like this? You should have waited another month or two. Like, this is what happens when it comes... I mean, yes, it was in development for three years with over 3,000 developers. And you can't even fix a simple thing of unlocking shit that's been in Call of Duty since COD 4. Like, give me a fucking break. This is the reason why I say this game is a bunch of dog shit. And then everyone's like, well, it's not that bad. No, it's terrible. It's awful. It's definitely the worst COD I've played absolutely the worst call of duty i've played even on this release day it's not good vanguard's release wasn't terrible it just became terrible over time season one messed up vanguard this game season one doesn't even start till fucking november 15th november 15th why like you should have dropped season one with the game 
to have people start grinding shit, like battle pass shit. Even though the battle pass should be included, it should not, like, if you're spending $70 on a video game, the battle pass should be included for at least the first year. Like, honestly, it should be. But yeah, it, it, it's just, I had to make this small video for this because this is absolutely ridiculous. And it's absolutely pissing me the fuck off. And the fact that Dead Silence is still a field upgrade is fucking stupid. So, that's it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, this hopefully will be the last time I talk about this shit until they decide to improve it somehow, which I doubt it because it's Infinity Turd. It's now the worst developer in the Call of Duty cycle. I used to be Sledgehammer, and now it's Infinity Ward because this is two, two titles from Infinity Ward that are both dog shit. So... And with Sledgehammer, it was Advanced Warfare was mid. World War II became better. And now we have Vanguard last year. So we'll see.